Barbie and the Magic Rainbow Barbie was a princess who lived in a beautiful castle with her parents, king and queen of Rainbowland. She loved to explore the colorful kingdom with her best friends, Teresa, Nikki, and Ken. One day, they decided to go on a picnic near the Rainbow Falls, where a magical rainbow always shone in the sky. They packed some sandwiches, cookies, and lemonade, and set off on their horses. Along the way, they saw many wonderful sights, such as flowers that changed colors, birds that sang melodies, and butterflies that sparkled like jewels. They reached the Rainbow Falls and spread out a blanket on the grass. Suddenly, they heard a loud roar from behind the waterfall. They turned around and saw a huge dragon emerge from a hidden cave. The dragon was dark and scaly, with red eyes and sharp teeth. It looked angry and fierce. It breathed fire at the rainbow, making it disappear. Then it flew towards the castle, ready to attack. Barbie and her friends were shocked and scared. They wondered what the dragon wanted and why it destroyed the rainbow. They knew they had to do something to stop it. They jumped on their horses and followed the dragon. Barbie's parents came out of the castle and saw the dragon. They were terrified and ran back inside. Barbie shouted to them, Don't worry, we'll save you! She grabbed a bow and arrow from a nearby guard and aimed at the dragon. She shot an arrow at its wing, hoping to make it fall. But the arrow bounced off its scales and did nothing. The dragon noticed Barbie and her friends and roared at them. They saw a large catapult near the gate and decided to use it as a weapon. They loaded it with rocks and fired at the dragon. But the rocks also bounced off its scales. The dragon laughed at their attempts and said, You fools! You can't hurt me! I'm invincible! I came here to take over this kingdom and make it dark and gloomy like my cave and no one can stop me. Barbie refused to give up. She said to her friends, there must be a way to beat this dragon. We can't let it ruin our home. Barbie thought hard and remembered something. She said, wait a minute, I know what can stop the dragon. The rainbow is the source of magic and happiness in this kingdom. It's the only thing that can weaken the dragon and restore the balance. We need to bring back the rainbow. Her friends agreed and asked, but how can we do that? The dragon destroyed the rainbow with its fire. Barbie said, We can make a new rainbow with our own magic. We just need to use our imagination and creativity. We need to think of something that makes us happy and express it in some way. It could be a song, a poem, a painting, anything. If we all do that, we can create a powerful rainbow that will shine brighter than ever. Her friends liked the idea and decided to try it. They each thought of something that made them happy and expressed it in their own way. Suddenly, they saw a faint glow in the clouds. It grew brighter and brighter until it formed a magnificent rainbow that spanned across the sky. The dragon saw the rainbow and felt its power. It felt weak and dizzy. It couldn't stand the brightness and joy of the rainbow. It screamed in pain and flew away from the castle. It returned to its dark cave, never to bother Rainbowland again. Barbie and her friends cheered and hugged each other. They had done it. They had saved their kingdom. They enjoyed the beauty of the rainbow and the magic of their kingdom, and they lived happily ever after. The End